when it comes to the day spring, you know, our neighborhood general, you know, so our process going through, we'll talk to the viewers a little bit about this of what we like to see. Obviously, the first step is, you know, come out, check the neighborhood out, pick out a lot. You know, if we need to have you there to, hey, yes, we can build this floor plan here, or, you know, this is the type of excavation we're going to need. These are the trees we can keep. So that is something we can work with, with you in that direction on, correct? Yeah, yeah, because these aren't engineered city lots. Right. They're natural lots. So the decision of what to build on which house has a pretty big decision part of it right on the lot you choose so yeah. trying to figure that out and you know we have three kind of let's call them quote unquote spec homes that you could choose from or a hundred percent you could customize anything i know that's been a question with our neighborhood a couple of times of well you guys just have three floor plans no we have whatever you want to customize we can do it we can build it 100 percent seem to do many different styles <laughs> and sizes of homes through the years so you know that first step is hey we picked the lot now we're going to jump probably have a conversation, put some money down on that lot, have a conversation with the architect. And um, KNJ Design out of North Branch, Ken Johnson, does an amazing job. We schedule a meeting with him, kind of put some preliminary information together, and that gets them a kind of a rough draft of a design. And, yep. you know, at that point, it's like, can we hit our budget? Does this does this design work for our budget or do we need to make changes and kind of going through that once we get that kind of determined? And that comes a lot with you. What What's that wait time, you know, for getting kind of an estimate it on really, a custom package? It is a full custom package. I usually tell people it's three weeks. Okay. Just, you know, sometimes we get it done sooner, but, you know, the lumberyard's trying to do 15, $2 million houses at a time. And right. They, they, trying to fill orders. And, yep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So, you when know. When you're full custom, it's uh, it's at least three weeks. Yep. Yep. And if you use our spec, we have pretty pretty simple pricing. That That's a pretty quick quick turnaround time. Yeah. Or if we have something similar that's going, we can generally price a little quicker. But right. if you're going full custom and full design, yeah, it's going to be a, a couple of weeks. So once we get that done, hey, we're good to go here. Um, you know, obviously work through paperwork contracts. And then all of a sudden it's, hey, we closed on this. We closed on the on the lot now we're what's that what's the next step now that comes on your end i'm i'm assuming the the lots there what are we doing we're gonna go get building permits yep you know the lots closed we're gonna go get building permits um that's been kind of a struggle lately um it ranges anywhere from two weeks to six weeks Ooh, really gotcha. depends on how busy they are they've they've hired, they put on some more people at the county so it's been getting better okay um, once that's happening we're breaking ground and we're going as fast as we can you know yep we, we Weather permitting always materials. General build time six months, six months four to yeah. eight months. Yeah, six depending months. on the size of the house. Yeah, if you're if you're seven hundred thousand and under, it's probably in that six month range. Four to six months. Yep. Four would be an outstanding, perfect scenario. Right. We have seventy and sunny every day. It's dry. We're, yep. You know. Yep. And the scheduling works for everybody. And yep. Yeah. Everything shows up. The perfect the storm. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Anything outside of that, you know, you're pushing eight months to a year for okay. those things over seven, eight hundred thousand. Okay, good to know for you know somebody looking just whether it's in our neighborhood or another neighborhood of there's your there's your kind of standard build time. Obviously, as the house gets bigger, the longer it's going to take. How do you how do you introduce the house to the homeowner so they understand what they bought, what the quality is, and what's that look like? We've had discussions about this that I prefer to do them, and yep. I know some builders would rather have you do it. Right. Um, I'd prefer you do it too. <laughs> why, why wouldn't you ask the guy who made it? Right. You know, yep. I'm not afraid. I'm, I'm honest. I'm going to sit there and tell you everything about the house that I know that they should look out for, yep. watch for, things that will happen. Brand new houses are not perfect. Right. Something will break. Something will happen. We'll come out and fix it. They're going to they're gonna settle. They're going to move right. along those lines. Everybody's, what's the builder warranty? What, what's your, what's so your standard basically warranty? Basically, how I follow is... I'm tied to these things for almost forever. Yep. It's just me, my personality. Um, one year, everything. Like anything happens to that house, I'll come out and fix it. I prefer not to come out and tighten doorknobs and change light bulbs, but you know, <laughs> done it before. If I need to, I'll do it. <laughs> um, outside of that, it gets to be ten years on like foundations and yep. you know it's structural things, something major that happens. Because generally, what the one two ten is what we the builder association call it. You know, the one year is that kind of the everything nail pops, yep. cracks, and because your house is going to settle, it's going to move. Yep. Uh, and then you generally have a two year on mechanicals, appliances, plumbing, things like that. Yep. And then you hit the ten year with the foundation. So that's your kind of general standard builder's warranty. 
if right. you know the question you have and you know as far as they call you they can call us and we can get get you guys set up that direction we'll reach out to the contractor if it's a plumbing issue it's we'll have that number for you you can call me you could or you can call our team or you could call wade and we'll get we'll get it solved and settled yeah so. I mean, i've built houses for mul- for people multiple times yep same people multiple houses and they're done living in a certain house. They call me to come back and get it ready to put it up for sale right. while I'm building their new one. Right. So, yep. I don't know. When I know the house, I might as well go fix it. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Another thing, a common question we get about you is, does he have a website? Why doesn't he have a website? Why doesn't he advertise? What? How have you grown the business? And this will attest to why we you know, partnered. But Sure. I have never advertised. Maybe once back in the 90s or something. I think I remember running a classified ad in the county press <laughs> or something. Um, outside of that, never. It's all been word of mouth. Referrals. And referrals. And honestly, it's probably been since 04 that I've had a day off where I literally didn't know where to go or do something. Yep. It's been nonstop ever yep. since. Yep, so. and that would attest why we obviously partner with Wade. Does a great job, and you know, and no his, website. His 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 work <laughs> speaks for himself. So he likes to stay a little covert, and that's you know puts yeah. us on the front end. So and you know, so now they're in there, they're happy. Obviously, we want to get more homes going in there. Why do you like the neighborhood so much? Why did you partner with us? I like you guys because you're very honest. I, w- I would tell people getting into this, if you're going to be a general contractor, you find a real estate agent that you really trust. You find a banker you trust, and you find an insurance guy you trust. Yep. The rest of the guys will come around. You'll find them. Right. I partnered with you mainly on that point years back. Right. We've been working together a long time. Yep. Why do I like Dayspring? I have lived out in that area since I was married. So back in the 90s. Yep. <laughs> uh, lived in that area, and I like that area. It's it's Chisago County, but it's also River Valley. Yep. Really, because it's rolling hills right. and, and nice properties. Beautiful setting out there. Yeah, yeah. You're kind of set out in the middle of nowhere, but it is, it's awesome. Right. Yep. yep. No one I would attest to that too. I mean, I've, I've, we've talked about a couple of times I've been chasing this. I've known about this neighborhood. I tried buying a house in the neighborhood and, you know, back in the mid 2000s and didn't end up getting the house. So, just have always had my eye on the neighborhood and actually, you know, doing my sales thing had found the owner. There's you know, things that happened, market crashed and, you know, a lot of different other aspects of it. But at that point was, you know, pestered him enough, I guess, <laughs> you know, did my follow-ups enough to say, Hey, can we list this? He was like, yeah, we'll let you list it. And went better yet. I'm like, how about I buy it from you if, if that's an option? And he was ecstatic to do it and we're ecstatic to have it and work with you and, it is a beautiful area out yeah. there. Um, yeah, it is. Currently working on trying to get the uh, road 385th paved coming to the neighborhood. Mm-hmm. So that hopefully Sounds will help. Sounds promising. Sounds promising. Sounds really promising. We're a one-stop shop. So you come in here, you can pick your lot, pick your house. We have pre-designed packages from a professional um, that put the packages together that, you know, if you don't understand what, you know, I don't know what cabinet goes with what tile or what, you know, how to select that. I don't either. That's, you know, my wife dresses me half the time. So, (laughs) or Brian does one or the other. (laughs) Those are things we have set up for that turnkey. Or if you want to get complex, we can work with that as well. And, you know, pick and choose who you want. We try to use and keep the contractors local, which is really nice. Shout out to Doug's Appliance. He does an amazing job. Pat up there has been amazing for me with my rentals and my our remodels, things like that. Yep. He's I know you've worked with but him. I for, try and buy everything there and everybody that does buy from there has nothing but great things. To right. Say, treats so. you treats you right. Also, you know, reflection flooring out of yep. Chisago. You know, they they're providing the the carpet, the vinyl, the tile, and I mean they're amazing people to work with as well. They'll sit with you and you know, what's your cab bring your cabinet and bring your tile and let me help you make this decision. Right. You know, otherwise as I said, we used uh Vicky, our stager, she put together some great packages for people if they they want to come in and say, Hey, I want option B and we can put option B with, you know, whatever house you choose and make it look the way you want it to look. Cause so. it does get stressful for people yes. picking those things out. Yes, it does. Yes, it so. does. Trying to make sure it all works and that's where the changes come in. And well, I don't know if I really like that. So right. that's, well, yeah. that's why we had a professional put some packages together for us to make life a little easier. Yep. So for sure. For more information on day spring, the neighborhood download our buyer's guide on the neighborhood uh, learn a little bit about wade and some packages we got and and other great information out there